हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू आवर यूट्यूब लर्निंग चैनल एक्यूरेट ए एस एम ई आई एस ओ दिस समर सीजन ऑफ ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री इज द राइट टाइम टू रिलीज दिस वीडियो टेम्परेचर एंड ह्यूमिडिटी इफेक्ट ऑन सी एम एम मशीन प्लीज डू नॉट फॉरगेट टू लाइक एंड सब्सक्राइब द चैनल लेट एस बिगिन नाउ Objective of this video is to know the effect of temperature on CMM machine. Why measurement varies with respect to time when same component with same program is measured on same or different CMM machine? When we say measurements or dimensions are varied, it means lengths and angles of the features are varied. Change in length is directly proportional to the temperature and component length the definition of the standard length of 1 meter is defined by the international bureau of weight and measures previously a physical 1 meter master was preserved in 1889 the meter was redefined by international agreement in 1983 as the length of the path travel by light in a vacuum in 1 upon 2997924584 of a second the definition also lock the speed of light at 2997924584 meters per second in a vacuum according to international standard A N S I B eighty nine point six point two, clause number four point one, fundamental rules. The agreement on the true size and shape of an object is that which exists at a uniform temperature of twenty degrees centigrade, unless otherwise specified. All dimensions and tolerances are applicable at twenty degrees centigrade, in accordance with. and c b 89 6.2 compensation may be made for measurements made other than temperature one must remember that as the variation range is large proportional uncertainty of measurement to compensate is equally large thermal coefficient of expansion different materials expands in different length with respect to change in the temperature this change per degree and per meter is known as material expansion coefficient the true coefficient of expansion say alpha at a temperature t of a body is the rate of change of length of the body with respect to the temperature at the given temperature and divided by the length at the given temperature that is alpha is equal to dl upon dt if steel bar as an example of a 1 meter is measured at 21 degrees it expands 11.6 micrometers in a length few of the materials coefficients are aluminum expands 23 microns per meter per degree centigrade steel expands 11.6 microns per meter per degree centigrade ceramic 6 microns per meter per degree centigrade glass 4 micron per meter per degree centigrade and granite from 6.5 to 7.5 microns per degree per meter thermal stabilization of cmm machine now let us discuss how long it takes cmm structure to thermally stabilize before starting the actual measurements normally users are much concerned about the cmm room temperature 
or at the most on the par temperature and its soaking but apart from those the cmm machine structure thermal stabilization is most important very innovative method was developed to take the continuous measurement data on cmm we have not used any of the length master or artifact for taking the measurement because of the main reasons are any of the master used of any material it has got coefficient of expansion and for research purpose compensating the errors is a very tedious job the second reason is that every artifact has got certain length or size with calibration uncertainty it is difficult to analyze full strokes of the machine axis because of the longer length master not easily available experimental procedure inside a laboratory of very controlled environment measurements were carried out continuously over the time in hours to days understanding the consistency of the machine behavior in response to the temperature variation repeated readings of measurement were continued after switching on room air conditioning readings were monitored until reach of consistent and repeated measurement consistent repeated readings demonstrate that the stabilization of the cmm system is reached the experiment setup the photograph shows is of a measurement setup of the system and the experiment carried out measurement cycle is started and continuously recorded coordinates and other parameters in certain interval of time x y and z coordinates room temperature granite bed temperature and x y z granite guideways temperature the experiment output and analysis the experiment was conducted on all the x y and z axis for the purpose of understanding only y axis data is shown here since y axis is in built of granite plate takes a longest time for thermal stabilization the trend of measurement as a output is shown in the graph the room temperature at the beginning was 23.9 degrees the measurement started at the time 9:30 in the morning the time at measurement got stabilized is 2:30 pm total time taken to stabilize the readings from morning to the 2:30 was 5 hours room temperature at stabilized reading started noted was 20.8 degrees the measurement variation from beginning to the point where stable data started measuring is 19 micron stable readings further over time 2.5 hours are in 1 micron please note this measurement carried for 1 meter y axis length conclusions question number 1 what is recommendation for cmm user by concluding this experiment answer is CMM user take a note that immediately after switching on the air conditioning in CMM room he or she should not begin the measurement immediately question number 2 what is normal time of CMM machine stabilization after AC is switched on 
the answer is perfect stabilization time period is never known if air conditioning is daily or frequently switch on and switch off also it varies with seasonal temperature variation of the ambient conditions like temperature humidity room size location and power of air conditioning and definitely the size and type of the machine cmm question number 3 what are the recommendation or guidelines in general to stabilize the cmm machine of 1 meter approximately measuring range with rigorous experiments carried out we recommend to stabilize the cmm machine at least 4 to 5 hours from the switching on of the air conditioning unit question number 4 are all the axes x axis y axis and z axis need the same time period of stabilization the answer is x axis and z axis certainly needed lesser the time than y axis since y axis is built at largest measuring range and on solid thick granite bed it required largest soaking time therefore until and unless all the axes as a machine system are stabilized cmm machine cannot be used for the measurement the question number 5 what are the recommendations or guidelines if guideways are of different materials built the answer is for all the bridge type cmm machines irrespective of the brand and make base plate and built in y axis is of granite material only therefore any bridge cmm of any make required the same thermal stabilization time Question number 6 If CMM machine is with inbuilt thermal sensors what are the suggestions The answer is all the thermal sensors are sensing and recording of the skin temperature of the materials and not the inside core temperature of the granite Structural changes are only take place when the temperature is penetrated into core of the material it means complete granite plate in full depth of thickness need to stabilize question number 7 what are recommendations for other than bridge type cmm the answer is experiment and analysis is awaited hope that you like this video please do not forget to subscribe the channel and share it to others for training inquiry please find the contact details on the slide thank you friends take care bye for this time see you soon for the next video thank you once again Sir, uh, we uh, thank uh, thanks for the concept you have explained in a real meaning, and the most important part was the case study which you have explained in a real and practical means, and uh, given the solution of day-to-day uh, uh, -day problems we are facing for several uh, months and uh, of various uh, type of problems. Thank you, sir.